Hey guys, this is Todd Gaines coming at you with a review for The Dwelling. The Dwelling is a Canadian horror film formerly known as Bed of the Dead. It played at a few festivals, but it's never seen a United States release until now. Our friends at Uncorked Entertainment have picked it up for distribution. And it's a story about two couples who check into a hotel room for a night of kinkiness. And instead of kinky, we get a bed with a mind of its own. Examining the dwelling, it appears uh, director Jeff Mayer, who's also the writer along with Cody Callahan, watched a lot of uh, Degrassi Junior High growing up. There's a lot of social issues in this movie, from police brutality to sexual deviance to unwanted pregnancies. It appears that our main characters are dealing with sins of their past, and they're also paying for those sins. No doubt my favorite part of The Dwelling is the excellent use of practical effects. But the only thing I didn't like was the opening scene. To me, it made no sense. I guess they're just trying to establish the fact that our bed has been killing for a long time. I like the characters a lot in the dwelling. Each of them brought something to the table. My favorite characters were Virgil, played by Colin Price. And our final girl, Alyssa King, she plays Sandy. Sandy's definitely my favorite character. She's got a great story arc. And is easily one of my favorite films from Uncorked Entertainment. Fans of horror, fans of bump beds, fans of king-size beds, fans of water beds. This is Todd Gaines, signing out. Thanks again for watching my review. Later.